goes back in an episode of My Garage Survival, we have this. It's brown. It's got a mostly okay engine on the outside. It's got one bad head. But it's rusting horribly. Um, Let's get our tools. You know this works. We're going to drive until it breaks, which usually happens in one to three episodes, depending on uh, <laughs> what's going on. But yeah, that's what we're going to do. Uh, wait a minute. Do I have a good braking system? Because I've loaded the game about a dozen times. And uh, because it, sometimes it loads, it loads weird. And only once have I got a decent braking. Okay, we got a good braking system. All right, we're, we're doing all right this time. We're doing all right. Could use some new exhaust parts, but other than that, um, let's put this in the front seat with me. Here we go. All the rest of this crap can go in the trunk. All right, so we are looking for, oh, no, is that, oh, the gas tank's not great. Oh, that means we're going to be leaking fuel. We're going to have to uh, rectify that situation as soon as possible. This this game is nearly impossible at this point. People talked about, oh, I've done it pretty easily. It's like, good for you. <laughs> I'm happy for you. It is not as easy as they make it out to be. What's this? That's a lot of transmission. Oh, hey, we got some more brake fluid. This may come in handy at some point. Especially if we find another car that's worth salvaging. But everything in this car is rusty as heck. So I'm not sure how long we're going to keep it for, but... Ooh, body hammer. Nice. That could come in handy as well. But so far, this is looking as good as any starting part of a run would be. That is a bench seat of some sort. That is for the lot of coupe. This is, what is that? Oh, it's trim. We got paint. Not much going on back here. Just, there's not a lot of good stuff here. Is this car at least all one color? I don't think it is. One of these was a different color, wasn't it? Yeah, it's got a black and pink thing. I wish I knew the color of that, but I don't think I can buy the paint anyway so if we're gonna get a paint to paint it it's gonna have to be off the shelf so we could always paint it but you know what i don't think uh i don't think it matters it's not gonna last that long anyway all right so let's go for a drive let's see what we got um that goes down to the lake and probably not a whole lot going on down there i would say we head right up into the mountains because the mountains are always trouble for us, and that, that's exactly what we like. So, trouble awaits. Okay, let's... Uh, I'm never going to look at everything else on this car. We're just going to do this. Fire up this monstrosity. Once again, we don't have a... Uh, a working dashboard, so we got to keep an eye out for that. Oh, God, it re it's really pulling to the right. Left, I mean, I should say. What is wrong with that? It's just suddenly it'll pull left for, like, no reason. Like, or, or right. Okay, we got something wrong up front here. Bad brake, maybe? Bad steering rack, possibly? Tie rod ends? It could be any myriad of problems. Let's take it easy on it until we figure it out. I guess we're going to go up into the mountains, because I feel like this car wants to go up into the mountains. It may be the only time we're able to get up into the mountains. Because we're going to end up wrecking the car at some point, and that's just kind of the way it is. Also, I've noticed, the reason everybody else does so much better at this game is because they care if they do well. <laughs> I'm just in it for the, for the lulls, you know? <laughs> I just think the whole thing is hilarious. And I couldn't care less if I do well. I just, I just like playing the game. Someone needs to remake the game Street Rod, um, similar to something like this, <laughs> where you buy the car to the newspaper, you fix it up, you drag race it. It's like the 50s or 60s, you know? Oh, God. Oh, this is not going to do well here. Oh, God. Jesus. What is wrong with this road? Okay, up and over. Ooh, what do we got here? Um, that goes down to a lake. Oh, that looks like islands down there. Okay, there's no brakes. There's no parking brake or brakes. What the heck? Oh, God. Oh, God. There's no brakes. There's no brakes. We're going for it. Don't blow. Don't blow. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on. Anything. Anything. Brakes, please. Oh, God. 
We must have a bad brake line. It's not stopping. It is not stopping. <laughs> I got the parking brake on as hard as it'll go. Okay. Okay, we're slowing down a little bit. This is not great. This is not a great situation to be in. I, I don't like this. Okay. Okay. This is... Oh. I hate it. I hate it. What is going on? Okay, we're in second gear at least. All right. Holy sugar. Oh, we got to be a little bit careful of the hills, man. Like, it slows down, but not great. Jeez. I've never had a, a car in the game yet that none of the braking system works. <laughs> oh, that was nerve-wracking. All right. All right, we're, we're okay now, anyway. Well, again, like I said, the parking brake sort of works, but not great. Oh, we got a building coming up here. Jesus. Okay. Okay, stop it. Oh God! I was th I thought it was I thought it was all over right there. I thought we we're gonna die. Perfect. Okay, let's get. Okay, it's barely stopping, so we got to make sure we give it lots of room here to stop. Okay. And stop, please. Oh God! It won't stop. Holy crap. Well, I'm assuming we're out of brake fluid? Yeah. We must have a bad line, like a bad uh, flex line, because yeah, that one's not great, but that shouldn't leak all the way out that fast. That one looks like it might be broken. Yeah, that one's broken. See? That's why we have no brakes. There, that one's bad, but not broken. That one's bad, but not broken. So it's really just, what are you? It's a mirror for a wolf. Hello, hello. Okay, that was a bit nerve-wracking there. Not having brakes sucks. This is about... This is, well, we're taking that. Okay, let's see. What are you? You're, you're an interior panel of some sort. A lot of food, not a lot of anything else. Can I just... There we go. I'm going to drink that. All right, perfect. Okay, so not a great first stop. I did see a blue thing sticking through the wall over here, though. What's that? Oh, it's just a panel for a lot. Okay, okay, so which way did we come from? We came from that way, so we got to keep going this way. Oh, there's another building right over there. Excellent. Okay, let's go do that. Ugh. If this will even start, because I, I always have problems with it. It just stops working one day. All right, let's go see if we can get over to that building over there. I think I got like a bad steering column or something, because this thing is, is twitching all over the place here. And I'm not a big fan of that. Can we get over there somehow? Is there a road over there? No, it looks like we're headed that way, sort of. Oh god, here we are. Well, we're not hardly headed that way, but we're I guess we're cross countrying now. As as every episode of this has ever happened to me, we end up going off road at some point. So here we are, off roading a muscle car. Okay, well there's a little road right here, so at least we found road. Dude, stop, please. Stop, please. Please stop. Okay, just off. Okay. Oh, jeez. This is nerve-wracking. Let's all get out. Not having brakes is one of the scariest things to happen in a car. I'd rather blow an engine than not have brakes. Oh, hello. Oh, look at this. No engine, but otherwise it's in all right shape. But do you have any... You know what? If you, if you have a flex line that's in any sort of shape that I could steal. I would appreciate that. Oh, that one looks like it might be salvageable. Is there any good ones, though? Oh, good one. I don't think there's one on here. Sweet. Okay, let's uh, bust out the tools, and we're going to steal that. Nope. 
Oh, there we go. Because maybe we can fix this not having brakes issue? All right, let's see. There we go. Okay, now I got to remember, when you take these things off, they like to fall through the world, so... You go, oh, God. We got to be super careful here. Which one was it? Was it... I thought maybe there was two broken lines. Oh, I can't see. I can't see. Dude. Do oh, great. What the heck? Dude, come on. All right, let's see. That one was alive. One of these was busted. Which one was it? Not that one. It was this one. Right? Yeah, this one's shot. See, it's got a big old hole in it. Now... This one should, I think, I think there's, if I remember, I always say this and I always forget. I think these are universal. Okay, yeah, that's not working. This grass is definitely there. Okay, so that should help some of the brake problem. Okay, let's see. Anything good in here? No, this is just kind of collapsed. Do I have any of those crappy tires? I do do not but I'm not sure all these tires are good either like look at this tire this tire is shot the problem is is that and so is that tire we can't really oh, I guess we could swap to these wheels it looked terrible on that car but the question is what are we more worried about Oh, look, this has got a good line, too. We should steal that. There, See, like, every car you can usually salvage something off of. It's not always great parts, but... Okay, let's just bring this in here with me. Because anything's better than what we had. <sighs> now, where was it? Was it up here? Did I see it? Yeah, there it is. Oh, look at that beautiful brake line there. There we go. Okay. This will at least give us, well, something better than what we got. I'm just going to push this back a little bit, see if I can get it onto the spot where there isn't grass so I can actually friggin' see. Yeah, because I can't friggin' see. All right, this should be a little better. I'll replace that one. This can come off now, and you uh, can go on here. Excellent. Yeah, look, bad tie rods. Look at this. Oh, and the whole steering box is shot. That might explain a whole lot of the way it's steering at the moment. So here's the problem. This tire is, sh which one was it? This tire here is bald. That one's all right. This one's bald. That one's all right. So we could pull like tires off of this and see if they fit just so we got tires with decent traction on or tread on them. Because otherwise, those tires will blow eventually, right? And these ones all seem to be holding air all right. So let's see what this one looks like. I can't tell if this was a diesel or not. Yeah, this these are three good tires. What size are these? 16s. Now, this one looks a little better than, I don't know. It's hard to tell. Let's get them out in the sun. These may all be in about the same condition. Ugh. Yeah, they're not too much different. But if we could swap two to the front and two to the back, and at least that would give us decent tires. Because, again, it sucks when you don't have uh I don't know if this one is diesel or not, so I can't risk pulling the gas tank apart to find out. Because you know how that goes. So uh, let's get the jack out. We'll swap around some tires here. See if we can't give ourselves at least two decent tires. Two better tires. And as much as I know it's going to look like crap, 
We're going to try it out anyway. Now, where's the first bald tire? That would be on this rear side here. Yep, I think so. Yep. Okay, so the question is, uh, how big are the tires that are on here? I, I don't honestly know. Let's see. Now, the jack generally doesn't pass through the ground, but we'll see about that, I guess. Okay, let me see here. There we are. Let's get you up. Is that as high as that goes? That can't be as high as that goes. Really? Jeez, that is not going to even get the tire off the ground. Okay, where's the next best spot? Can we jack it by the suspension? All right, let's try that. Ooh, that'll work, but will it stay there? That's the, <laughs> that's the real question. All right, let's see. Okay, let, where did I put the wrench? Did I put the wrench away? Yes, I did. We just got to be kind of quick with this because the jack likes to slip around. There we go. With that off. What size is that? 15s. Oh, geez. We got lucky there. Okay. Perfect. Holy. We got real, real lucky right there. All right. Okay. Let's get this jack down. Don't worry. We'll try to put two of the same on the front and rear, obviously, because, you know, aesthetic th Let's see. And this this one's kind of flat anyway, so maybe we'll do both both rears on this side and hang on to the front ones for now. I guess because I'd hate to do like three different wheels. I think that would suck. All right. Mm, yeah. Okay. Here we go. Let's see here. Where's my thing here okay here we go let's come on dude just get off oh my god off you come new one on please <sighs> it looks terrible but it's gonna have to do and it's definitely not as meaty of a tire so again swapping this out is going to be a bear, but if we just swap out, where's the ball tire? Is it this side? Yeah, we'll just swap this one to the front, even though it's softer. We will, uh, it'll, it'll be riding a little weird, but at least it'll survive the trip, right? That's kind of, and I got to make do with what you got in this world. Okay, let's see. Oh, no, not a good spot to jack there. Can we just do it by the front? Here, the cradle here. Will that get up high enough? I don't know. It just wants to slide around on it. Um, can we just jack it by stupidly jack it by the engine? Maybe. Okay, that's off the ground ish. Hopefully this works. There, there's one up. Come on in there, buddy. Oh no, buddy! Come on, please. Don't do this. Oh, no, that's great. There we go. Okay, crap. <laughs> Can we just get this up under there? Please don't damage it. Ugh. Oh, God, I, I just about have it every time, and then it doesn't work. There we go. There. Okay. Perfect. This can go back in here. Uh, this jack can come down to a softer, but at least a little better conditioned tire. And this can go back in here. And I think we got brake fluid. So let's try filling this up. Oh, we got a little bit of brake fluid in there. I thought it was all gone. And we'll try to fill this up with brake fluid. All right. Let's see. Let's see if we can't, uh, make this work oh no oh it's filling it's filling and let's 
Looks like that's empty. All right, perfect. I'll put this back in there. Excellent. Okay, I think. I think we're good. I think we got all the parts off that we're going to ever get off that. So, sorry, tires. It's going to ride funny, but yeah, like I said, it still, be, it still beats having bald tires. Let's see. I could keep the wheels, I guess, bring them with me. And if I ever find a wheel changing doohickey, I could throw them on, but really not worth it. Okay. So we're, oh yeah, we're going to go back down that road over there. All right. Let's see here. Please start. If, if you don't have, if I have no start condition, I'm going to be upset. Got it. All right. Let's see here. That's off. Well, we're going to find out if it breaks. Okay, it stops. It stops, at least right for now, anyway. It's probably leaking brake fluid, but we'll find out. Now, this is really dangerous on these roads here. Because it just wants to suddenly wander. Okay, so things are improving. Now, if I can just find a decent set of wheels, I can toss on this piece of junk. Okay, this must have... Is this the... Okay, yeah, we're falling. Oh, there we are. Yeah, it would be nice to have working gauges to know how much fuel speed we had going on there, but apparently that's not going to be the case. This may be the way I came, possibly. I, I don't even remember. But it doesn't matter because we just got to keep driving and, oh, okay, yep, finding places. Whoa, look at this. This reminds me of a road right near where I used to live, actually, where it just kind of went off the side of the road like that. <laughs> yeah, we got to get the steering fixed if we, if we find something that's similar, at least. I want... I, are the Bart and the Chad, do they have inter any interchangeable parts? I can't remember, honestly. But I guess it'd be nice if it did. Oh, yeah, the brakes kind of work. I like, oh, what's this? Now, is this where I came from when I started? Well, maybe not. Maybe? I don't even know. The doors aren't open. Oh, God. Okay, here we go. Now, this parking brake barely works, but at least it's something to hold it in place in case we're on a little bit of a hill. What's this? I don't think this is where we started, because there's new things back here. Like wheels and more jacks and a steering wheel, which is sweet. And a drive shaft for a Neve and a nice 15 inch wheel and some body putty and a grill for a wolf from the looks of things. And do we have a hammer? I don't remember. Did we grab a hammer? Yes, we do have a hammer. So what do we got? Is there anything behind this place? Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. Ugh. Why do I always find the ones that don't have a car? That sucks. Well, maybe it is time we paint the whole dang thing. It is turning nighttime after all. You know, nice late evening paint. Is this handlebars for a bike? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, okay. I know it's pegs for a bike. Never mind. Let's grab this color here. I like the lighter colors because it makes it easier to spot. <laughs> so we're going to paint. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Mint green. The mint green monstrosity. Yes. I love these mint greens. I don't know why. Old 50s trucks look great in these kind of pastel-y colors. I'm so sick of black, silver, and white cars. I've talked about this before, and I, I hate them so much. Because every car on the freaking planet is that color now, and I, I don't understand why. So boring. Like, come on, people. Stop being boring. Show a little pizzazz. Now, don't get me wrong. My BMW was black, but again, I didn't... It was already made when I bought it, so... <laughs> I didn't really have a choice in the matter. 
But color's not that important to me. I'll drive one. It's just I hate the fact they that's all you can get anymore. Go to a lot sometimes. It's crazy. I was lucky I found my car in the color I did. All right. That's one of the better stories I've ever had just driving by and books is all like, hey, look at that car over there. It's like, oh, I love that color. Let's go check it out. And <laughs> an hour and a half later, I owned a car. So <laughs> there we go. And onto you. You can be sprayed a little bit. There we go. A little inside of the door spray there. A little underside of the door. Get you right in the undercarriage, bud. All right, bud. Look at you. Just turning all friendly green colors. Oh, wait a minute. It's this way. Okay, let's see. Perfect. All right, let's see here. Um, it's it's not going to be a perfect paint job. I'm just trying to get everything the same color. And it's one of the easy colors to get. So if we find another paint place, we can, especially if we find somewhere to repair this rust. There we are. I'm not looking for perfection. I'm looking for good enough. Why is that popped open a little bit? There we are. Whoa. Why did that happen? All right. There we are. Get that side there. Reach across this hood as far as we can reach. Excellent. And that there. Oh, oh no, it ran out again. Damn it. So much paint. Oh, okay, I don't want to get in it. I should probably close that door. It'd probably make it a bit easier. Oh, here's the they get this pillar here. There we go. That. Did we get the driver's side door? We did. Is that? There we go. Oh, I like how it's discolored around <laughs> the rust. All right, there we go. Okay, that's... Did I dent the trunk or something? Or is that just I didn't close it, maybe? There we are. Right along this panel here. Okay, I think we're as good as we're going to get. Oh, maybe the jack's just caught on it. Because it, it just doesn't like to tip over there we go perfect all right let's sleep and then we'll uh head out in the morning i guess <sighs> close the door everything's ignitions off right okay let's sleep oh, shoo, shoo. Ooh, nighttime excellent okay now we're here again let's get that off and then it's cranking really slow and that has me a little nervous but all right, I think we're uh, good to rock and roll here. Geez, I may make it through a whole episode of this and not actually break the car. Probably not, because I'm still driving like an idiot, which I generally do in games. Oh, you should have seen me in Forza Motorsports. Eh? <laughs> Forza Horizon? Jeez. Driving like a maniac in that. That game I play with my steering wheel. That's, that's a fun one. Most games I find it doesn't benefit from the steering wheel. Like um, one of my admins, Crunch, is always the crunch word, is always saying, oh, you should play uh, Snow Runner with the steering wheel. It says it's an awesome experience. And I'm sure, like, I, I've tried it. It's good. But I don't feel like it's necessary. Like when I'm sim racing, yeah, it's necessary. But... For, like, that game, I don't feel like it would be. Although, I'm glad he really likes it. And, and apparently, they've done an excellent job implementing it. Well, okay, yep, we're going off the road. Which I think is awesome. Oh, wait a minute, there's a building over there. Cutting it. So, maybe I should try it out with Crunch one day and see if... Uh, Crunch, do you want to play uh, Snow Runner? I'll bust on my steering wheel while it's sitting right here beside me. I always have it ready to go. I just don't feel the need to use it most of the time. There isn't too many days in real life that go by that I don't uh, already drive. So I don't feel the need to always be behind the steering wheel. Sometimes you just want to jump in and play a game like this, and this is what it is. 
But if Crunch says it's good, I believe him because Crunch is usually right about these things. So, oh no. All right, let's see. Crunch is about one of the best admins you're ever going to get. So kudos to Crunch. I love you, bud. Uh, so if you ever see Crunch on the Discord, which, by the way, if you want to join the Discord, it's in the description below. We also have merch and stuff if you care. I never promote these things. Uh, <laughs> to, the, to the chagrin of a lot of my um, admins and stuff. We also do community days every Saturday. We're playing Minecraft recently. Or, yeah, every Saturday morning starting at 9 a.m. my time. Uh, just so you can reference the time, I release my videos at noon my time. So if that you can do the math from there. Um, Eastern Standard Time, I believe it is. So, is, there, is that what the road I was on? Yeah, there's nothing here. This is trash. Feel free to do that. And uh, Books, check out her Hi-Fi channel. Books, or sorry. Um, Books has a lo-fi channel. So if you're looking for music to study to or whatever, it's called uh, Hey Guy Lo-Fi. And she does... Uh, lo-fi uh, hip-hop kind of stuff for studying and whatnot. It's great. I, I really enjoy it. I've used it when I live stream sometimes. Which, by the way, again, live streams are coming back uh, with the Star with Starfield uh, coming up. So I got an early copy of it, so I'm going to uh, be playing that when I'm allowed. So please join me for Starfield. It'll be a, probably a very long stream that day. Uh, sorry, Crazy. I know you're not a huge fan of space stuff. <laughs> I love crazy. Now, where was it? Aha. Let's see. Oh, here we go. We got another building right up here. This is so far very building forward. Always got to slow down a little bit because the game can act a little weird when stuff spawns in. You want to be going as straight as possible when stuff spawns in. I don't see anything. Thing. Well, okay, yep, car just fell out of the sky. All right. I keep hitting that windshield wiper when I get out of the car. Let's see. Oh, geez. What? What kind of human atrocity is that? All right, let's see. I keep finding jacks. I'm wondering if they're hinting I should have multiple jacks. <laughs> see, this is the car I was hoping for. When, it, when the world spawned in. Because these ones are usually the most common. Oh, this has got a spring broken out of it and everything else. You got a, you got a brake line on this puppy? Well, wait a minute. You might. No, you don't. You do not have a brake line. Everything else here is garbage. It's garbage. It's all garbage. Uh, no, the oil filter is non-existent. <sighs> Nothing good here. Keep running into these not so great places. Well, let's head up the road. Um, that's all we can do. Car's looking pretty fresh, minty fresh. Uh, there we go. What are those mints that taste like chalk? That are green, this misty mints? Are they? <laughs> Every old person always had them. You used to get them at restaurants when you'd leave. Excellent. Here we go. Whoa. I feel like in order to uh, survive most of the world nowadays, I need way more, way more tools than this. Especially to keep a car running in the, what appears to be some sort of apocalyptic event. Whoa, okay, yep, we just got a little caught up there. We're all right. seeing oh wait a minute wait a minute i see something was it or is that just a hole in the forest it's a forest hole this is the end of a road where did the road go that was just a horse forest full <laughs> forest hole oh god slow down i can't see we're now just driving across the country again well best bet is to usually roads exit at lakes but yeah, there's one over on the far side there. We'll head over there. Usually if you find a lake, the road will uh, exit. Uh, a road will exit. Not all the time, but a lot of the time. 
I don't know why, it just happens to be a thing. There we go. And road. Sweet. Okay, look out. There's little cops of trees, and off we go. Out here is this a building there's a possible building sighting up here unless that's just terrain again well maybe not I probably shouldn't be going this fast oh that is a building right there crap jeez I don't like crossing this it's like I've said before playing it sometimes there's rocks and you'll hit them or there'll be a sudden dip and you'll get those and it'll uh, it'll wreck your car real fast. Oh, it's something all right. All right, let's uh see what's going on here, I guess. Let's see. We have a grill of something. Oh, geez, not much good going on recently, is there? We got some tuna or corn, I guess. I love corn. Um, guacamole. Okay. Wow, nothing. Okay, this sucks. I don't like to be too long at one place. I'm surprised I've never found a car with an automatic. Maybe they just don't spawn in the survival world. Now this will take us back to the road we were on. There it is. Oh, this looks dangerous. What the heck is this? Excellent. Here we go. Huh. Oh, God. Okay. Yep. There it is. Yeah, we're right at the edge of a cell here, loading in. A chunk, maybe they call them. I don't know. Every game calls them something different, but... Is that a road? Is Are we seeing... Is that a... What is that? Is that just the edge, or is that a road? I'm actually trying to look over top of stuff, and it doesn't make any sense. Okay, here we go. Road. I'd love to know how fast I'm going, but... Nothing works <laughs> on the dashboard. At some point, we're going to run out of fuel, but I guess we're not going to know when it happens until it happens. I should really be checking those cars for gas, like, you know. Oh, no, we got, we got decisions to make. I like this way. When in doubt, turn left. We've made a couple of good upgrades on the car, though. New tires are great. It doesn't look good, but at least it functions. You know, in, you know, function over form in this game. <laughs> if I have the money in, the, in their base game to make it look good, I'll do it. But that is not the way this works. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, goodness. There we go. I've actually been messing with, oh, oh no, oh no. Unity recently. It's an interesting game engine. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh God, what am I doing? There we go, we're kind of out of that mess. 
Jeez, what was that? Is that a building? Well, that was some serious luck right there. Okay, oh, is that a brand new spring? I think I may have a busted spring. Dude, stop, please. Thank you. Ah, let's see. This is... Yeah, this is... Was this a, let's say a left spring? Leaf spring. Okay, so it doesn't matter. But I think one of my springs is... Yeah, this spring here is shot. So maybe we can replace the spring. That would be awesome. Anything else here? Not so much, eh? <laughs> All right, well, this isn't the worst. Getting that spring off is going to be a problem. Dude, come here. What happened? Why, why can't I grab that? Oh, that's why. Oh, goodness. Why would you pick up? Okay, maybe I'm not going to. There. Okay. Jeez. What do you? What do you? What are you doing, buddy? Okay. This is going to be a problem because this car doesn't like to be jacked up. It likes to fall off. So. Okay. Let's try to. Let's see here. This is going to be a real bear. Okay. You just please stay. Now. Can we manage to get the spring? <sighs> okay, I want to take that off. That. 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 And th oh, one more. That. And then we got to get that out. And that out. Okay, so that takes off the broken spring. And now we should be able to bop that in there like such. Tighten that down there. Oh, wait a minute. Did I just... Did that spring just break putting it on? <laughs> or is it already broken and I just... Oh, no, I just didn't notice. Well, that was probably it. Okay, well, not great. <laughs> but I guess I could have sworn that looked fine going on, but I guess I I guess I was wrong. So, there you go. Okay, dude, come on. Don't do this to me. Well, that was a waste of my time, wasn't it? All right, so there we go. Well, I'm going to end this episode here because this is as good a spot as any to uh, to leave it. Um, there, there we go. We'll make, a, we'll make a, a bumper out of this. We'll get two of them, weld them together, and that way it springs when I hit something. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment, maybe subscribe. Maybe get your friends to subscribe. Maybe get your dog to subscribe. This is the Avengers here. They really uh, need some extra money. And if you didn't like this, well, you probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I'm not much of one. Thank you again so much for watching. Love every view I get. Scapegoat. Before anybody says anything, I forgot to tighten the shock. I remembered. Out. Out.